Dear Heavenly Father, we just thank you for this time of fellowship. We ask that you be with us now and touch us and guide us. Thank you for the lighting of these candle, candles to symbolize life, beauty, life, and the continuation of your word and your missions to move forward in the world. We thank you for this opportunity to be together, to share the energy of your love, your compassion, your kindness, and your information, as well as your wisdom. We just thank you for this time together and ask that you bless it and bring it into a great fullness for whatever purpose that you would have for us. In your name we pray. Amen. 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 Maybe we should hang this around the gym so we can keep track of them. That's a great idea. He could use it too. Yeah. When Max goes over there, maybe he can. Hey, Max, you going over where Jim's at? Oh, yeah, I'll go there. Okay, you want to hang this around Jim? So that keep, way we can see him. Keep track of him. Oh, that's right. Lost in the dark. All right, so let's, let's go around over this way. The candles look beautiful. Yeah. Reflecting the beauty of them. Hello. Yeah, I welcome everyone. Uh, I just wanted to say that it's a great combination of four elements, fire, air, water, earth, and life. And it is a great opportunity to help through that combination to help local ecological situation and global ecological situation. I invite you to Join me with, with Om. Just a second. And then Angie will take it from there and then Jim.
あとこうてあさにやとちゅちゅちゅこわいとこしししてこわにちちこてちちあかとことしししゃにててきやたてかわあしゃにててこちゅあたかにみやとこおあああなしあちゅちゅこわににやけたあさそいやおわあかにやに
guy is a sad thing. And we will cleanse the waters. And the fire will watch. The souls will embark on a journey to another place to bring back an energy that is not here at this time or sometime in the future you will all transform maybe difficult to understand what we are saying but we know that you will understand the spirit of god and the angels that come Greetings, I am Michael. No. I look out now and I see the land like you cannot see it, for it is in darkness now. But I see each and every one of you with your soul light and the candle that you hold. Let it be known that you are here to uplift the spirit of the land of Gaia, to uplift the working of the elementals, to cleanse the waters and the skies, to be a part of a great cleansing that comes from beyond as well. I'm going to pray in the angelic language for all that is around us, within us. One moment. Tirian Dadi Kasham Vipatu Adonai. Ashian Sandu Bora, Akian Dandi, Endura Shang, the end on the Vasha, Elian Gaya want to or a Kashandi Tats. The Noti Vashandu, Kira Kanshandi Sasarias, Nahara Kashandu Riatandu. Mishka, Koshonzi Zas, Tari Aranda Basu, Ukatanya, Yashanzi Sande Tararandu To, Adonai Kopwa, Yeshua Shandiato, Mokori Adan Negata, and Zenjikas, Sila, and Shondi Koshitiendo To. Tire Rando Kama, Found a wound at Kiara. Shanti Vosa. Bow your heads. With your third eye, see all that there is in nature that cannot be seen with the eyes in your head. Take into consideration all realms that exist, one on top of the other. Now take care of this realm that you are in with your blessings and prayers, understanding that God is on your side and that the elementals are with you in keeping charge and taking care of all that is here. Brace yourself for your missions to come. They are beautiful, expansive, 
and miraculous, but not always easy. I thank God for all of you, for the light that you are to one another, and for the light that you will be in the world, and the example that you will set and carry forth from this day on. Not that your example was not shining already, but a new meaning will come. A new understanding will come to your mission. And it will inspire you. Enlighten you. Entangle you in God's will for your life. And I pray that you cannot be untangled or want to be. Nezia Sangdu, Kashipyati Andadar Aranai Karabondi, Lakrata, Katatanji Sundavesh, She and Shanzuzash, Senzi Denzi Tararandi Kapo, Okrara Kajanji. May God look down now and cleanse all the things in this area. The water, the land, the sky, the earth, the fire. The hearts and souls of every one of you. The intent that is placed within you. May it also be a fire. Fire of purity and love, of unconditional love. So many believe they have it, but fall short. And then realize it's not as easy as they thought. But unconditional love brings caring to each soul when you reach it. They will know when you have it, where they will identify it in you. It cannot be mistaken. It is an example that is shown and not just spoken about. You cannot say, I have unconditional love, and then have it. You must beseech God and cleanse your system and spirit to find it, to know it, and to make it available to all that is around you. Unconditional love is for all, and not just for one, or for a few or for all but a few, but for everyone. And if you cannot reach out your hand to the leper or the ugly or the one that smells badly, if you cannot embrace them all, then you have not really embraced anyone fully. For unconditional love is all-inclusive and if it's not all-inclusive then it's limited listen to my words limited love can be seen listen to our friends the frogs they're saying yes i know We've been treated badly, too, sometimes. <laughs> but they know unconditional love. For they have it one for another. They have it one for another. Open yourself and have it one for another as well. Do not fall short on that account, for it is the greatest of your examples that you must bring. For when you show that you have unconditional love, 
You will be welcomed by those that need your presence. When I say need your presence, it will be those that are in need of that love. Sare Sombi, Aliaranda Kash, Biasanzi Aduna. Weep for the lost, for the wicked, for the unfortunate for the sick. Beseech God for their health, for their salvation, for their recovery, and for their inclusion. Beseech God in all his love and kindness and compassion and wisdom for all the things that are needed on this world. For there are days coming that will be difficult. And they will need these things. Thank you for your dedication. Thank God for your heart because it is there to be filled. Your life is here for reward as well. It is not all going to be taken, but there will be much to be given to you because once you give a blessing, you receive so many more. Do not ever refuse a blessing from someone else or you re refuse multiple blessings. If someone wants to give you something from their heart, take it, for it is a blessing to them to give it to you and a blessing for you to take it. Remember these principles and never lose track of giving and taking blessings, for they come back and they resurface and they multiply. They multiply. Have not the blessings that you've received here today multiplied in your heart somehow. And when you leave here, they will also multiply out there. They will see that you have a bit of wisdom that was not there before, a bit of light that was not there before, a bit of understanding and compassion that was not there before, but it is there now. Praise God for that. Biasandu Kariasa Sharia Rande Gatia Tavara Indi Sutiata Kororondi that all nature proclaim that God is king. Let all nature proclaim that God is king. Thank you for listening to me. God is with you. Feel his presence all around you in nature. Hear the sounds of nature around you. They give thanks to God always. I will give it back to you. I 
I will not go away, but I will hand it back over to Max for a while. Sisi <laughs> Open your hearts to the Lord, and he will bring blessings to it. Give thanks always, and always be delighted in the presence of the Lord. Sing, dance, enjoy your life, but also be steadfast in your missions, and understand that he will bring you joy in all that you do. Um. Join me in all and ch and, 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 and chanting. Allah uplifted. This area has been sacred for such a long time. And now it's sanctified. No one can touch it. For the vortexes here are strong. The life within this area is intact. And the elemental are now very happy that Yarata and Zikashi Nariyati. And may God be with you in all that you do and all that you are. And let these moments of beauty and light stay with you and remember them when you pray. Remember them when you are alone and let them bring you joy and life and understanding. All right. A closing prayer, and then we shall leave this place. Our friends, the frogs, are praying along with us. Lift up your hearts. Lift up your minds. And thank God. Praise God. Give him glory, for he enjoys it. But more than that, he deserves it. Yeah. He created you, and you are beautiful, and you are awake, and you are useful. Thank God for these things. And he has let you know about things outside of your world, and giving you understanding beyond those things that the world understands. You have 
a head start. Praise and thank God for that. And now, finally, I want to thank each and every one of you for coming. You may not have felt anything in your heart or mind or senses, but this was a time to gather, to bless the things that are around you, to give thanks for those things that secure you on this planet, and to let Mother Gaia know that you care. Much love to you in the senses of spirituality that ever move forward and the ascension that is with you daily. Amen. Amen. We'll close with a chant. It's just so beautiful to listen to nature. Mm -hmm. To realize that all around you, there are so many creatures. And we're all living in harmony right now. Thank you for being here. Enjoy the night. It's really a beautiful night. Enjoy one another. And learn from one another. This is a rare time to be together where there is no condemnation and no condescension of any sort. And you can lift one another up in love and that's a beautiful thing. Just thank you for being here. Thank you. Thank Much you, Michael. <laughs>